Hello, beautiful people. Thank you for viewing Lydia's insights. And now, well, now, and now, and now. As sprinkles, 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 a bunch of his ass and all that jazz. Wow, woo, woo, woo. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, yeah, enough playing. Um, so look at that. Look at that. I have to turn around to read it because I'm looking at it and it's all upside down. Anyways, I did that to remind myself to that it will happen. That which I pray for, that which I dream. Just keep on waiting and trusting and believing. And I forgot what that one says, the paper right there. I forgot what it says. Um, but another reminder to myself. And then my daughter, my youngest daughter, she did that. And then a friend of mine down in Southern California gave me the love you more. And... Um, yeah, so yes, I'm. it's late, and to be honest, I was like thinking, oh, I don't want to do the video, and it's already late, and, and then I don't have um, any makeup on, and so, you know, I just don't feel very pretty, I don't feel very good, so, so that's like all of that, and just being tired, so, um, as you know, those that have been watching, I started every day last week um, work at 8, 8 a.m., which meant I had to wake up at 5.30 and that was pushing it for me um, because I have a morning routine and so I do um, reading in the morning, Bible and some other books in the morning. Um, then I um, go drink coffee eat breakfast and since it's so early I'm unable to like I would eat two eggs two over easy eggs um, that would help me get through the, the day until my 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 break but now since I started eight eating one it's just hard for me to eat that early in the morning and because I just it doesn't feel right I just don't feel good in my stomach it just like it's like saying no it's too early <laughs> you're supposed to be sleeping right now um so um yeah I'm, I, so that's like it's kind of like messing me up in a way because i'm lack of sleep because i don't know about you guys it's summer and right now this time <clears throat> so what i mean by i don't know about you guys i'm like as if people around the world are watching me well maybe eventually i don't know <laughs> but not right now i know that's not happening so right now y'all know that it's summer and it's like not going dark for us here in northern california um it's not going dark until like 8 30 8 45 and it's like so and then i'm not so yeah so the sun's not going down then the kids are it's off for summer and they want to stay up and then so me basically i'm not getting to sleep till like i think the earliest i've been getting to sleep is like 11 30 and then getting up at 5 30 so um on friday uh i stay from 8 to 12 8 to 12 because then I, I take i have my class that starts at one so um but on friday around 11 30 um I started feeling not good and when I say that I wasn't feeling good I wasn't feeling well it's because I was feeling like I was a seizure was gonna happen so I'm starting to feel sickish and so I stopped with the calls and then um, I just listened to my co-worker the one that's also being that's new and being trained along with me we were doing calls on our own that day on Friday on Thursday I'm sorry because today's Friday <laughs> Okay, see, I'm tired. Um, anyway, so yesterday, which was Thursday, Lydia. Um, yeah, so we were taking calls on our own. And so she received a call that I had just received. And it was a call that she said, oh, I'll call back in a little bit. So I was like, okay. And then um, so my 
coworker got the same call and then so I was just took some time was just trying to listen to how the call was going for her and um yeah but I wasn't feeling good and I started I got I got carrots out I started munching on the carrots and that helped me a little bit but what I think I really needed was protein and ultimately what I really needed was sleep but um yeah and then so after after work I went for like a half hour to the van and I was just like debating whether to stay for the class or if I should go home um, and I was just praying and of course asking God for strength and wisdom on what I should do and I just ended up staying for the class and the same thing happened as what's been happening um, for the class which is there's that stretch of time where I'm just like it's <laughs> so hard for me to just sit still and listen to him um, on giving the lectures but I am talking about theater so it's only a, like like maybe like a I think yesterday he did like an hour of lecture so but um then he has us do some stuff that's like gets me out of my comfort zone right like um I think one of the first things that he had us do was this like some of us stand in a circle and then we're supposed to do like a trust thing and you just like fall back like and then the other the people behind you which everyone's close and they were supposed to catch the person and I thank God I didn't have to go in the middle but <laughs> um, so we did the games like that and it does help because I do feel more comfortable with the people and so then he had us learn each other's names and stuff like that and then um, one of the things that I just got done doing yesterday was to tell a truth or a lie and the class was to decide whether it was a truth or a lie um, and so I did that yesterday and it was maybe like the ones that were honest and truthful there was some that, that said no I don't believe her um, and I did tell the truth I told the story about my um, my brain tumors and so yeah they were like no so it was that was fun I, I enjoyed that I enjoyed I enjoyed hearing them like they didn't believe me I don't know why I don't know like well I mean honestly if you think about it it is kind of unbelievable you know um seven kids they know that too and then the brain tumors and then if they knew the full truth of everything <laughs> it would be oh they would be like no so anyways guys i'm just like jabbering and jabbering and jabbering so i'm gonna go um and hopefully i am able to catch up on all my sleep right and i was able to sleep in today and it did feel so good so so good um all right goodbye beautiful people thank you for viewing and i just want to say a special happy father's day to any of you who's viewing that is a father and keep up the good work and all right god bless bye bye